Hello guys, uh, I have here a MacBook Pro 2021-22 model number is A2338 and the problem is not turning on ok, let's connect the charger and we will check what happened on the DC power supply so putting the charger pressing the power button and as you can see it's just uh, 130 milliamps and then dropping it down to zero and then and not turning on okay try another one the second port exactly the same thing I will just check okay it's only drawing 5 volt I will just move a little bit here and show you here see and it's only drawing 5 volt remove the back panel let's do some measurements this fuse is as far as I remember is on uh, 20 volt but we are getting only see it's fluctuating and this is the battery coil whereas it should be maybe this is a 12 volt battery but we are getting only 5 volt Yeah, this must be on main power. Five volt, and this should be three point three, and we have got nothing here. All right, now let's look under the microscope. No, I can't find anything here. I would like to disconnect the battery and see if anything changes on the DC power supply. Pressing the power button. Yeah, a bit of change maybe with the battery connected it's taking it was going up to 150 milliamp because there was a 5 volt on the battery coil so yeah it's still not turning on so I have to remove the bolt hate removing these bolts So the board is out. <coughs> okay. Yeah, both sides see it looks pretty clean. Anyway, let's have a look at the back. Let's check around the uh, PD controller first. <coughs> what is it? What? Do you see? It's a resistor flying around here. <coughs> this one. It was here, where it came from. Uh, there is a bit of damage here. Do you see that green thing? See here? And here? 
Yep, most probably it came from here. And bit of rust here as well and here. Anyway, we will keep it aside. And just keep checking. Anything which is noticeable beside that thing? Nah. Where is it? Where was it? Here. Yeah. Let's go closer. Is this also solder here or? First of all, let me check what this is resistor is uh, this side here this one so these are two PD controller and see this I see here and there is one resistor here which is RF262 and this is where the little bit of damage is and this is connected to UF260 pin number 1 SPI UPCICL but is this resistor is so important if it's not there it's yeah but it also connected to this PD controller pin number A2 yeah PDF that's the one here RF293 uh, this pin number one is connected to all these three resistors is it connected to yeah it's connected here as well so we will come back and see if there is a connection between them because if this resistor is not here that means all the connection which is coming from end of the resistor and let's check here come back here come back microscope uh, is it here or it's gone see but that's fine even if it's gone we can still connect these together is this the only problem Yeah, now we can see clearly. Do you see? <laughs> but what track is this? This one is this? Okay. But is this track is going here? It is going on the other side because this I can see here so there should be a resistor here connected with this resistor and this ok now how we can do it maybe I will put it like this and then I will run a cable from here to here. Okay, I will. Okay, so this is done. I hope you guys like my artwork. Okay.
Okay, let me put it back together, huh? Okay, now let's check if it's successful or not. Look at the DC power supply, see if it's yeah, see it directly goes to 1.3, that means yeah, it's turning on, as you can see. Yeah, that's all done. Um, thank you for watching. See you in next video. Bye.